In short, NOSTA is Twitter without Elon Musk <laughs> and without a centralized company. NOSTA is similar to the Bitcoin network in that, that it is a decentralized network protocol, but not for money, but for a social networking system. So there is no centralized company behind NOSTA. It's not a product, just like Bitcoin is not a product. Twitter or X, how it's now called, is a product of a company. But NOSTA, the name, uh, by the way, stands for notes and other stuff transmitted by relays. Yeah, a rather complicated name, but NOSTA is easy to remember. And in this decentralized network, anyone can start to run a relay, which is a computer uh, comparable like a node in the Bitcoin network. And anyone can start using it. And these relays distribute the information throughout the whole network. And another big difference uh, to Twitter is that everything you share is uncensorable, meaning that no one can lead meaning that no one can delete what you posted or can hinder you from speaking your mind, which is why it might become a communication tool for activists who otherwise are being censored by those in power. And from that perspective, uh, Nostra is very interesting. And it's also very popular with Bitcoin users as it shares the same principles around decentralization and privacy. NOSTA also allows users to zap each other, meaning that authors of a post on NOSTA or a note, how it's called there, can be immediately paid within the platform just with a click by their readers. So if you are a NOSTA, you have your profile and you can connect it with your lightning address that you can get, for instance, at GetAlbi, the wallet, the lightning wallet system. Uh, so it's very easy to set up. And then from the, when you have connected your wallet with your Nostra profile, you see um, the notes of other people, just like on Twitter, the feed, and you see a small um, lightning bolt. And if you click it, you can immediately send Satoshis to the person to the offer of the note, which is great because people get paid for what they are writing and it's very easy. So NOSTA and Bitcoin, or let me say NOSTA and the Lightning Network are basically very closely connected to each other. Another similarity to Bitcoin is that you have in NOSTA, you also have a public key and a private key. It's the same with Bitcoin where you have a public key which becomes your Bitcoin address and your private key or private keys, which are um, basically within the seed, these 12 and 24 words you have from your self-custody wallets, these are your private keys. And the, the principle is the same on Nostra. And the great thing about that is also that if you have the private key to your profile, you can use any app that you want. So you can switch within the apps. Okay, it's a little bit complicated. I try to explain it in a different way. So on Twitter, if you have a Twitter account, you go to x.com and there is your Twitter account and you need to log in there. You can't take your Twitter account to Facebook and open it there. And the same way around, you can't take your Facebook profile and put it on Twitter. It's, it's different systems. It's different centralized systems. But within Nostra, you can, for instance, because the question was also which apps are good to use for Nostra. So if you have a, an iPhone, for instance, you can use the Damus, or maybe it's called Demus, I don't know, um, app. D-A-M-U-S, or you can use Primal, P-R-I-M-A-L. I'm using Damus. And also on Android, I think one of the good apps is called Amethyst, like Amethyst, like the stone. 
And um, exactly what I wanted to say was, you can then take your private key, which is the basis of your Nostra profile, which gives you the property over your notes um, and your profile. You can take it and use it in any Nostra app, meaning I can use Damus if I don't want to use this anymore, or if I change to an Android phone, I can open up Amethyst, import my private key and have my own feed again. So um, it's very flexible. I'm very mobile with uh, my feed and my account, and I'm not depending on any companies or any app providers which is a, a great thing actually for Nosta. So I could imagine um, that Nosta is becoming the next big social network, to be honest. It's a decentralized network. It has many advantages um, against or uh, over the, the centralized networks, which, yeah, they can censor your posts, they can shadow ban you. Um, you're totally depending on the social algorithm. Like for instance, just take me as an example uh, from my experience with Twitter and other social media tools where there is an algorithm basically deciding if your tweets are being shown to more people or to less people. If you are, um, if your focus in your work is on a topic that interests less people, if you are not maybe, um, um, yeah, speak a German accent in English, um, maybe not so many people want to watch your content. And then the algorithm takes this as uh, the reason for showing even less of you. And it's the other way around, you know. If you if you are watched by many people because you are, I don't know, you are allowed, uh, you say controversial things, um, then the, the algorithm pushes you up so that more people see you. And this is magnified, like uh, it's repeated, repeated and repeated. So those who are the loudest are seen and those who are not as loud and maybe more reasonable or something like that are not to be seen. And this is something that doesn't work on Nostar because Nostar doesn't have any of these algorithms. So you can basically build your own feed. You build your own feed of people or voices you want to see or hear um, and no one is interfering with that. And I believe this is a very positive side um, about Nostar and also um, that it's a decentralized network and the interaction with Bitcoin might really be something that also brings Bitcoin adoption to many, many people who have never heard about Bitcoin and will maybe even never know that uh, the sapping on Nostar is powered by the Lightning Network and in the future also by eCash. Hello, my name is Anita Posch and if you liked that video, please subscribe to my channel now to inspire me to create more content like this. And if you want to learn more about Bitcoin, then sign up for my free weekly Bitcoin newsletter at anita.link news.